Hello everyone and welcome back. Today I'm working on this page from Johanna's Christmas and I just thought I'd show you here. I've done a couple of drawings in myself. So I've got these two little Christmas trees that I've put in on the side here just to fill up a bit of space. And also up the top here I've added in a moon and I've put in a little Santa on a sleigh with a couple of reindeers as well. So we're going to probably color that in all black the reindeers and everything as a bit of a silhouette I'll probably add a few more things as well but I'll show you that as we go along for this drawing we're going to be using Prismacolor Premier pencils I have the 150 set so we should have plenty to work with so I'll probably be doing this in two parts so for part one I'm going to be doing the backgrounds and sort of the border and for the second part I'll do the house. So let's get started. As you can see here, I've actually erased out two of those little well, cake slices, if you want, the red that I put in, just because I realized that there was it didn't match up with the number of um, little wedges. So I decided to go threes and threes rather than every second one. So just go ahead and color the way I'm coloring from here on in.
Now the remainder of the frame is actually just a repeat of what we've already done so I won't show you that. You can decide to do that now if you want or you can wait until you finish with the rest of the picture. I'm just going to do the top and I'm going to do the left hand side and I'm going to leave the other two because I'll be putting my hand all over it anyway so I don't want to smudge it too much.
Now I mentioned that I might add in a few more drawings and I've decided to make some little snow, snowy mountains in the background. So I'm just going to draw them in now just so I know where I'm going to put my sky and everything. So I'm just going to add like a little northern light in the background so I'm just going to color out that before I do the actual sky. Now I'm absolutely no expert at this, this is the first time I'm coloring one in so I have no idea how this is going to turn out.
Now I'm just going to go ahead and do the same thing for the sky on the other side and then I'll show you how it all looks in the end. Okay, so it's time to start with my snow. So I'm starting out with just a very light color to cover everything. And I'm gonna do this on both sides of the house, but I'll only show the first side. Both will be pretty much identical.
Okay, so that's all the snow on the trees finished. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to finish off the snow down the front. I might add in a few more trees on the side. I'm not sure yet, but we'll find out afterwards. I'll use the same technique as I used with the little trees. Now these little lollies on either side are exactly the same so I'll just show you the first two on the left hand side and then you can do the same thing on the right hand side or do something completely different if you want to. And there we go, that is part one finished for you guys. You can see that I finished off the snow down the front of the house and that I did end up adding in one more tree on the right hand side, just a slightly bit bigger than the, the other little ones. And I hope you enjoyed this part one. I'll be back with part two where we'll finish off the little house. I wish you all a fantastic week ahead and stay safe and I will see you again next time.